what's going on y'all so today i'm about to be showing y'all how to send cryptocurrency from your coinbase to your metamask wallet also i'm going to be showing you how to add a coin on the metamask wallet because sometimes people would think that they lose their money and it would just be that they didn't add the coin on the uh, metamask wallet so i'm gonna jump in and show y'all how to do that real quick and we're gonna wrap this up so basically you want to go to your coinbase you want to go to send and receive you want to pick the cryptocurrency that you want to <clears throat> excuse me yeah but you want to um you want to pick the cryptocurrency that you want to send over to your metamask wallet so let's say we're going to send uh well i ain't gonna i ain't gonna send none so we ain't gonna we ain't gonna do that but um so basically, let's say one inch. Let's say I want to send a hundred dollars worth of one inch. I would, <clears throat> I would do that. Put the hundred in. You would go to your MetaMask wallet. You would copy your MetaMask wallet address. Paste it here. And then basically, at that point, you would just push continue and then they'll charge you a little fee and then it'll be sent to your metamask wallet now this will be excuse excuse me yeah so anyways um so this is how you add the coin because more than likely it's not going to come up if you haven't interacted with the coin before on your metamask wallet so this is how you will add the coin add coin Go to custom token. Now you will need the token contract address. So basically, all you will need to do is go to Etherscan. Etherscan is the pretty much the website that I use or CoinGecko to find the contract address for the cryptocurrencies that you that you use and you know deal with. So let's say we're looking for one inch, right? One inch contract address here's etherscan then from this point on you would just copy the address of the coin token tracker that's how you would be able to see if this is actually you know the the real token and to say it right here right by the token tracker one inch token okay so after you copy the contract address, you would come add token, custom token, token contract address. Go ahead and paste that address that we just copied, and it should pop up one inch decimals of precision 18. So at that point, you will push next and then add token. And now you have it in your MetaMask wallet. But in my case, it says zero dollars because I didn't send anything over. But you know, once you send money to the wallet, it, it'll it'll pop up and it should be there. And again, um, I don't know, I don't, I don't know if I I forgot if I said this or not, but MetaMask wallet, you can only send ERC twenty tokens, and um, it's ERC uh seven oh one or something like that, but not to guess let's go ahead and look it up and find out and then we're gonna wrap this up metamask holds Yeah, it's <clears throat> it's it's one of them tokens. But yeah, you wanna you wanna do your due diligence. I can't I can't find it at this moment and I don't wanna take too long on a video. But 
yeah, you want to do your due diligence before you even try to transfer any money over from your Coinbase to your MetaMask wallet, because you gonna make you can make a mistake and fuck around and and lose your money. Uh, for example, I know MetaMask wallet doesn't take DAI, which is this coin right here. It's a stable coin. But MetaMask Wallet doesn't take DAI. I, I, I fucked around and I made a mistake one time and I sent like 30, 40, 40 something dollars over there and, and the shit is lost now. It's lost in crypto space now. So that shit gone. But yeah, that's that's pretty much how you, um, you know, transfer the, the money from the Coinbase wallet to the MetaMask Wallet and how to you know, retrieve your, your token. Well, not really retrieve, but, you know, add the token on there so you can see the, the funds that you have in the, the MetaMask wallet. So, yeah, that's pretty much that. And, uh, I'm going to wrap this up.